Hello everyone. Um, just to fit a new glow plug, a few tips. As uh, you are probably probably aware of, the ceiling point is very important to be clean before fitting the new one. That's the reason why, personally, I'm using a reamer. A reamer which is going to clean inside the engine head, which is going to clean the stepped section inside the uh, engine head to, to make sure the new glow plug will seal metal to metal contact properly how to do it just first of all i put a little bit of this special grease on the reamer itself so the result of the cleaning will be shown uh, of the amount of grease which uh, will be taken away by the cleaning process and eventually in case of debris carbon debris i just fill this section of the reamer with grease in this case copper grease so the possible debris induced by the cleaning process will be taken over by the grease and will not fall into the engine and into the cylinder so here we go So, here is the reamer in place, and I will just turn it a few turns, pushing and turning, pushing and turning, pushing and turning. You just take it out, and well, let's see the result. This is quite okay, because as you can see, there's a concentric pattern of contact with the reamer on the stepped section and the amount of carbon um, deposit on the grease is very limited so now the well is ready for fitting a new glow plug this is a new glow plug this is a OEM one um, I just put uh, another video to explain you why my preference is going to dedicated OEM glow plugs. Feel free to, to, to look at it if you feel like. This is a special grease, ceramic based, high temperature, especially designed for this purpose. I'm, I'm not blinded by the threat. What is the most important was just to make sure this area are protected for against carbon deposit. Socket 10 millimeter, few extensions, and of course engage the thread by hand. 10 to 12 turn. I like this quart wrench. Why? Because you don't apply too much force. If you go. Torque wrench, 12 Newton meters. If you go.